Okay, welcome back. Here we are, and there is the settlement we have just claimed by name of Karas Sand. Why the elves would have a guy all the way over here to talk to dwarves, I have no idea, but apparently they do. Silly geese. And that is an actual dwarven army. I think I need to go down to this settlement first. Siege that out, kill them all, and then move on that one in Rubar. As for this front, what is going on here? They have some very good units. Some of them really good spearmen. I don't like that, I don't want to attack into that, I just don't. Okay, you got your path blocked, you get over it. Karasant, what about my army? My army looks not excellent, but okay-ish. Obviously, there's been some attrition throughout these long years of war, but... Uh, I don't know. I really don't know, actually. I might be able to move down south with this, depending on if we can actually move out without everything collap collapsing, and we can. You know what? For one thing, let's build a watchtower, but let's try this. I mean, if we can move this way, then that would be a very good thing. Oh, threatening to kill my family. And that's one of the good factions, people. Isn't that wonderful? So we have Blacksmith, which is up to male, and that's it. What about Bree? Great Market or Drill Square, which is all well and good, but... Um, and where, oh where, oh where, Armorer, so heavy male. So, all of these... You need partial plate, right? Right. So, suppose that's that. You need mail. Yeah, most of these need mail, but the heavy stuff needs partial plate, which I can't actually give them, can I? So, <laughs> what does it matter, really? Oh, you're shredded. Go and retrain some of your numbers there. It should be fine, you should be able to do that. Cash-wise, still doing okay. You're gonna need a lot of troops, so I'm at gonna start recruiting at least the heavy stuff. Just, yeah, go for large amounts of good troopage. There we go. That should be rather... No, that should be a good start. I'm gonna check if I can recruit anything interesting here. I can. Good. Works are always good as well. Mech. Don Assassin might be good. Get one of those. Get two of those. A few more spies over this way might be good too, actually. So let's get some of that goodness as well. There we go. And as for here, I think that's it for this turn actually, unless I want to actually attack. Okay, you are still just building that right, so let's end the turn and see about doing this. Let us see. Yeah, so the good guys lost, as was to be expected. I mean, they haven't technically lost, but um, they've kind of lost. Let me guess, ceasefire? You're not gonna get one. No. Yes, no. They do have a lot of dwarfenry there, that's not so good. Okay, and that is a actual real elven army. It's making me kind of nervous. I think I'm gonna attack that with the Balrog actually. Oh look, that's a dwarven army too. A big enough one to be a thing. Interesting. 
So the dwarves are pretty screwed, but they're not completely screwed. And we're gonna need a lot of resources aimed at the, you know, vest here. Including some generals if we can manage it. Bringing some more generals over could be useful because, you know, just, you know. Those generals I have are all over in the Far East. And that is not where I need them. Or I'm gonna need them relatively shortly, so... Mm, where? Ukur of Dale, no. Trading post closed, that is bad. Trade increase. You have become a strategist. Oh, holy crap, you've gotten good! Okay. In that particular case, you're going straight over there. Because, like, really, free general that I can just send over there that's, you know, really good. <laughs> Fuck yeah. As in, not free so much as one I'm not using. Might I have one somewhere here? No, doesn't look like it. Kill the spare. And I don't really need to hold this, so again, kill the spare. We have Shagul the Noble, so that's essentially three armies I can equip with generals on top of these two. Which is um, actually fine. Yep, they're not gonna fight yet, unfortunately. Okay, and I have no problem with fighting them out in the open, right? As for this, let's see, what's the auto-resolve look like? Mm, no, not with that. I'd rather just siege them out. They'll need at least two turns to get at me. So that's two more turns they'll be melting their own troops through attrition land. Dwarven Axeman. Meh, not impressed. Let's head on over here and we're ready to... Yay, actually... It's apparently a rune castle even though the, it's colored as a... Dwarven one. Okay, so this looks like it's under rune control, so that's perfectly fine. And I have no problems with those news. Oh no, this looks like... Um, looks like there's three Dwarven settlements that I need to take out, and that should be relatively manageable. We have three good units here at least, but four. And their faction leader, of course. Yay, King Thorin. Fun times. And this should be doable. Right. Okay, as for here, it appears that we have a lot of troops ready to go. I think I will be forming up yea, another army here. Huh, and we can retrain another unit. Wonderful. Not this one, though since we don't have enough stuff yet. Great market, no less. Hmm. The Dunedain culture is suddenly going away, which is nice. Okay, so... Let's assume that we want some ballistae. There. Like, yay, so. Or something. Right there, that sounds good. And some catapults, in fact. Well, that's a lot of artillery, but it might be useful against elves. Then we want a halberd line to actually, yay, hold the things. Uh, halberd, halberd, halberd line. Oh, that's some good halberding right there. Head on over there so you can... Oh, you won't be able, because we won't have partial plate here up at the front, will we? Oh well. It's not gonna be ready this turn anyway, so it's fine. Get you in there, that's three. 
which is well good it's not gonna be enough two of these and the nearest general really don't want to risk the elves getting Vilya back but I mean what's the chance of me actually losing that horribly right <laughs> I just jinx myself I know it okay so that's a halberd line and some range support lots of range support in fact go with that this is a huge encampment uh, show building browser and smiths requires drill square so I have the large city I just need a drill square to upgrade that oh well then we're building that next apparently okay so two more of the halberds we're gonna put those back in actually you know I don't really have to I suppose but sure okay if I put in two more halberds that would put me in a really good position but maybe I should just do this instead try to go for a you know just go for meat grinder tactics try to force their lines to collapse and as such more archers even if it is against elves may be useful so we're gonna try this army and we're gonna send it over that away and of course you can't fight just yet do I not have a spy nearby nope doesn't look like it what about in one of these cities any forgotten agents nope oh hello we actually have a thing here and plenty of a thing in fact let us uh, see about sending him over that way a general with his escort moving towards a thing I really don't want to have to attack that that would be a really sad day for me if I had to attack that two turns for that and one turn for that of course we're not gonna attack here we're just gonna hold in siege mode if you know when we attack that but you know as a thing okay so that's essentially another army formed up which is rather nice and now it's just a matter of directing massive amounts of forces over yay that way to absolutely smash every trace of my enemies they are rushing to aid that city you know taking that as a field battle I would actually be happier than fighting it with you know in the city walls considering how many troops they have and the choke points they might end up having available in city or rather pretty inevitably will have available it's kind of um, I don't know it does not seem like good idea to actually provoke that kind of a conflict to enter that kind of conflict it would be really bad for me health wise I mean that's the thing I'm not sure that I could take it right because my reinforcements probably wouldn't arrive until much later and then I would be storming the walls with one army against a full stack of you know men which is they're not elves but they have some decent troops there and longbows out in the field for even if it's for them that's like meh but four longbows in city walls that's a different matter entirely sure generals are good even if they're really crappy ones how crappy were you completely crappy right god damn it where the fuck were you in Moria no possibly in Goblin Town the fuck was he totally just lost him end of turn report richest faction okay you're writing you apparently expand it you know what I will do actually I'll trade out all those catapults well except maybe for one 
for Ballistae. I'm gonna go for Ballistae Heavy Range on this one, on this army. And the next one can have a Catapult Heavy one. Yay, so. That does mean that we'll move out a little... You know, actually... Do I even need a Ballistae? Actually... I mean, I have two, but... Do I need more? I'm not so sure that... Well, we're gonna wait for some anyway, but... Yeah, we might be able to do without that. You just uh, keep marching down this way, that's fine. Winterion Yaur. No way to... Proce actually... Uh, sure. Execute. Okay, there we go, and now sieges it. We're just gonna sit here, right? We're gonna force them to come out towards us, because... Then we can shoot at them some. And we can just charge at them freely as well, and just generally make a nuisance of ourselves. And we are out of moves, apparently, because... Oh no, we can attack the city, but I think we'll move over to Mithlond next turn with the Balrog's army. Okay, that should be fine-ish. This is four turns away from Ye Surrender. It has lost a few troops, it seems, but not that many. Oh well, anyway, it should be fine. And there we have one, two, three good units. As in three elite units. That would be a problem situation, I suppose. How's our cash? We're still making plenty, so that's good. Let's make sure to queue up some more good troopage. Yay, so. And... Right, you're relatively useless, but make a ballista maker all the same. Good. Good, good. Good enough, anyway. Ooh, archers. I like archers. I want archers for support. I mean, with the... Uh, with ordinary orcish infantry, not so much, but with a good halberd line. Oh, yeah, that's some good shit right there. And then... Uh, I don't know. Three halberds, I suppose, and send it over to Bree. There you go. Sounds good. And there's a lot of elven armies gathering here. It's gonna be a big mess, it seems. In a totally wonderful way. Okay, anything I'm forgetting? I think that's everything. It's all the fronts covered. Oh no, no, it's not. I can try and assassinate someone. There is that. Yes, kill him. Assassin dies in action. Okay, that's the High Lord of some kind. No. Wait, what? Just... Ah, never mind. I think I was misreading something that I just... Spies? And assassins, sure. And yay, assassins, of course. Agents? Spies! Yay! You can spread out and discover the lands. Okay, you. Right, you're recruiting, that's fine. Not gonna give them second general since we have a pretty serious. Ah, oh, shit! You had to. God damn it, they remembered the move order. I'd... Fuck! That was not according to plan. Oh well. Okay, so the plan is to set up proper armies, then park them in brief for retraining and rearmoring to, you know, do the upgrades, and then we'll move them out and send them towards the elves. And Bree is gonna be our staging area. I mean, we have been building up it, building it up for years now of game time, and I think we should use it, you know. I mean, if we're gonna use it as a major base, we should use it as a major base. And hello, they're coming out to fight us straight away. 
Okay then. Apparently we are expect look at that experience on those bastards. Shit, son. Okay, the more we kill of them the better. Even if we don't win, we need to do some damage damage to them because this is bad. There's enough of them to Yeah. This is essentially a half strength army if that because it has, you know, crappy infantry and it's really not that good. Okay. Okay, control. Okay. You may fire at will. You will form up right here and again fire at will. I know I have more orcs than that. I will, however, try and do something yay so where I will park them like that and just try and form a V shape so that I can uh, sort of run in and cause trouble actually for you as well just park here and like so good run and you just so that you can shoot in fact 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 until things get nastier I'm gonna put you behind rather than in front just so that we can um, you know make nasty things happen to good people and you go with God damn it. Right there. And of course you can shoot, and of course you will be formed up in your own group as my wonderful glorious cavalry. Run into position, you will sit right behind these, giving them morale support. You run, get in position. Okay, and you should use fire. And yes, any of these mega strong units that get slaughtered by ballista fire is a really good thing, I think. Okay, apparently they're bracing. Okay, now we can actually see what we are hitting, if anything. Okay, kill. Yes, I think I can win this. It's just a matter of actually winning this. Come on, get in position. Get in position, archers. Okay, so our orcs are formed up according to my cunning plan to crush them between two flanks. Get in position. Come on! God damn it, archers, move it! Are you still not ready? just horrible horrible okay now we're shooting that's good at least there's something happening and the longer they take to form up and the neater their lines when they do form up the better it is for me I mean look at that 13% loss is already 14% and most of that is those ballistae I'm just pummeling them to death Okay, it looks like we are seeing some movement, so... Let's do this, and... Oh, no, 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 no! Not cool, not cool! Okay, that's just axe drawers. They're moving towards my main infantry line, so that's fine. But do shoot at the central ones, please. Dragon Slayers. Uh, that does not sound like... Run! God damn it! What the fuck did I tell you to do? Dwarven nobleman, eh? Dwarven freaking nobleman. Okay. We're still firing. It's still fine. No! Move not! Okay. Balliste, I'm gonna need you to draw back a little bit. 
Oh god damn it. Do not lose your things. Get out with your engines. Okay, so this is being a mess. And get out, please. You just push through. Okay, you getting killed is not according to plan. You move it up here. Okay, you. Okay, I want you to make these route, please, if you can. Yep, defeat is distinct possibility. Or okay, interesting, interesting, interesting times. Okay, head over this way. Kill their siege, in fact. Because, you know, fuck them. Okay, those are just orc bands. That's my general. We want to save him, probably. What about here? Okay, what about here? Let's just charge the rear of that. And that, in fact. Yes, but no. Do not get caught on that, please. Keep charging. Yeah, you can charge that unit, I don't mind. So, how's that going on? Okay, so we are killing them slowly. We are like slowly, 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 super slowly killing them. It's a good thing. That's my general getting engaged with Axeman. I want one unit to charge that and fix that particular problem. You just get over here and fix that. Okay, so this is a thing. Why the fuck are you not shooting? You are on skirmish, you dumb fucks. Get back up to the front. Get back up to the front. That's Walt Wardens. Kill those, please. They seem like tough bastards. No. Get back on that and then shoot them. There we go. That's good. What the fuck are you caught on? Dwarven warriors. Really? Well, that sucks. It's in fact bullshit. Come on. Yeah, so that's essentially a phalanx. Phalanx equals bad. Phalanx equals badness. Okay, so I should be able to win this unless my troops actually manage to break, in which case I'm boned. Just saying. That's random max draw bullshit. Okay, get... Get out of the... Way and... There we go. Just set up a nice charge and... Kill some more of these Dragon Slayer bitches. Okay. Oh, I certainly hope so. This is a major stronghold. At least as far as their remaining holdings are concerned. This was... Charge in. I need you to get a bit of oomph going here. Not good enough. Get over here and form up and be ready to... Okay. Yes, actually kill those axe throwers if you can. That would be good. Now, turn around and kill. Charge. There we go. That's the ticket. Go, 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 go. That's a nice charge. You know... I kind of hated the dwarves a little bit at the very beginning, but I quickly came to realize that they're actually pretty awesome despite their weaknesses. And holy crap, a lot of my cr stuff just vanished. Oh, that's just war units and freaking... You know, that's just those wargs which were killed in action. If you could charge those in the rear, I would be extremely happy with you. You know? There we go! Kill them! It's not as many kills as I had hoped. Okay. 
move you f closer to the front. You, who are you pummeling? Kill those. Actually, ooh, nobleman. Actually, much run. Much run and... Uh, the fuck? No, be on the ballista and shoot. It's fine, just be on the ballista and shoot them. Oh, crap, that flank collapsed. That is not good news. It is not good news at all. Just get over here. And did I not fucking take you off that? What the fuck? Okay, so losses. They've lost a lot of troops, which is good, but some of my crap is routing, which is really bad. In fact, let's go and charge that, shall we, while we're at it? Yes, run, and you. Kill that one while you're... Well, while they're still there. Okay. Just kill. Just pummel them into... Yay, nothingness. Did you not kill that many? Why? Okay, maybe we can route something here? I mean, there's practically nothing there. Why are you even... Ho why are you still holding? You know? Okay, so the second group is still alive and let us form up a thing. Yay, so. Yay, so. Okay, so that routed, which is not so good. Yes, fire at will is fine. Fire at will indeed. Okay, now then. That's the layout. A layout that is really nasty for us at times. Kindly shoot at least once at the dwarven nobleman, please. Because I would like to see them die some. Okay. Kill that. The fuck are you actually fighting? Jesus. Oh, there's a unit of dwarven bullshit there. Disrupting my attempts to fire arrows at my enemies. Wonderful. Gotta love when that happens, huh? Come on, you have got to be dead, right? Okay, you are. Good. Just form a pride behind that. That should be fine. Oh, you have unrouted, which is good. You sit there to give morale. Okay, and how's that going? Not very good. Okay, let's uh, get over here and charge those Dragon Slayers in the rear because we do want to rout those. Those are, or rather, kill them. They're one of the most dangerous units here, so... So, let's uh, see about... ...getting some things happening. Okay, we did a charge. Time to pull out with what few of our works. Yes, they are getting their upper hand, unfortunately. I might lose this. Unfortunately. Okay, just press in and swarm them with numbers, please. I mean, how well can they freaking well hold, right? Oh, and they're using their Vault Wardens to dick with things there. Wonderful. Kill. Oh, bad decision. Getting arrowed by my own guys. Actually, how about we pull fast one? Let's head in there and actually... Capture the town center. That should be nasty enough, right? <laughs> the gates close. <laughs> oh, holy crap, this is so fucked up. Yeah, well, fuck you, bitches. All we have to do is hold for, what, three minutes now? Might be able to do that. Yes, yeah, be on skirmish, in fact. Just run away from them when they get too close. So, how's that looking? They're pretty... Oh, they're heading in there, though. So, no, but it did disrupt their efforts a bit. 
at the price of actually sacrificing our cavalry since I won't be able to escape with them now. Okay, let's just swarm these then. I mean, yeah, let's just swarm these. Okay, you move up. Unit routed. Wonderful. Yeah, I think we're. I think we're gonna lose this. Unfortunately. I'm sorry, but that does appear to be the case. Unless we can kill enough of them, but. Maybe if we kill their leader, but don't count on it. I think this is gonna have to be finished off by the next army. Just saying. I mean, don't get me wrong, we should still be fine. But you know. Okay, so we are... Yeah, I think we're gonna lose here, unfortunately. It's close, it's really close, as you can see, but... Um, you know, they're gonna win, unfortunately. Unless we kill that general first, then maybe, don't count on it, but maybe. Okay, kill, kill, kill. Yeah, no. No, we are boned. We are boned, boned, boned. So much for this. Okay. Fair enough, save your hides, you may now proceed to run. That includes you, General Guy. Flee. It is now allowed. Yeah. That's cute, but you still have to run away before you all get slaughtered. I mean, this army is gonna be shredded, there's no question about it, but you know. Still, we did kill a fuck ton of them. Many of them, they're elite units, right? So. The next army is gonna just have a cakewalk, really, in killing the rest of this. Actually, I'm just gonna quit the battle. So, 340 dwarves left. That's, uh, that's pretty low, I would say. That is pretty damn low, and that should be relatively easy to handle. So, that's... Uh, Sure. Yeah, I'll accept the ransoming. Why not? How far are you gonna pull back? Up to there. Okay. Oh, and if you want to face me out in the open, dwarves, that's fine, too. Okay. The elves are gathering a stack of death. A stack full of death. Pointy ear death at that. That's gonna be fun. Yeah, they're really trying to gather some troops. They really, really are trying to gather some troops. Which is cute for them, I suppose, but sucky for me, of course. Okay, so... It's pretty much as could be expected. The Orcs of Gundabad are fighting their battles there, possibly beating some peoples back. Which is good. I'm actually gonna focus on this southern southern part a bit more and let the Orcs of Gundbad worry a bit more about the northern part of things here. You know, in the west. And that should be a nice division of labor which would benefit well both of us. Okay, camp sack. Okay. No, no, best not. Dale is the richest faction. Dale, of all people. It's Dale that's the richest faction. And the High Elves hate me. Really, they, the High Elves hate me. However will I live with myself? But, uh, okay. We've gotten this far, but I think I need to split the video here, so I'll uh, see you in a little bit for another one.